hello and welcome back to ion cg max today we are going to see one question from 2006 turkey max olympiad the question is given find all the integer triples x y z such that x minus y z equal to 11 and x z plus y is equal to 30 now i personally find this question to be very interesting and hope you like it as you are going to solve this before we start don't forget to pause the video and try it out and also if you are new to the channel please subscribe the channel and give it a thumbs up thank you let us start the problem here so here uh, only two equations are given now uh, x minus yz equal to 11 given x minus yz is equal to 11 and uh, xz plus y is equal to 13 so here how to solve this uh, if you add if you multiply if you divide uh, it is not possible to get the solution here <coughs> so the logic is there uh, so here first of all uh, you will square and you will add uh, square and add x minus yz whole square plus xz plus y whole square is equal to 11 square plus 13 square squaring and adding up <coughs> so here what will get uh, x square plus 2xyz sorry minus 2xyz plus y square z square <coughs> plus x square z square plus 2xy 2xyz plus y square is equal to 121 plus 169 so here what will get a uh, 2xyz 2xyz cancel so here you will get a uh, x square <coughs> plus uh, x square z square plus y square plus y square z square uh, is equal to 290 uh. so here if you take a common uh, x square common 1 plus z square here you can take y square common 1 plus z square is equal to 290 so here you are getting the factors x square plus y square into so here you can write z square plus 1 equal to 290 now how to solve this <coughs> so here uh, we are going to write the factors of 290 uh, he is asking the integer triple sum uh, integer solutions uh. so here are the factors you are having 1 into 290 second one uh, 2 into 145 third one uh, 5 into 58 and the next one 10 into 29 so these are the factors we are having here so here if you take z value you will compare with z value so z value should be 1 more than its square one more than its square z value should be one more than its square uh. so here you can take one you can take two you can take five you can take ten you can take 145 and you can take uh, 290 uh. so here uh, 58 we are leaving uh. so 29 also are leaving the remaining we are taking uh. so here uh, if you compare this if z square plus 1 is equal to 1 first one i am taking case 1 z plus z square plus 1 equal to 1 then 
z square is equal to 0 means uh, z is equal to 0 then what happened to x <coughs> x is equal to you are getting uh, 11 <coughs> and y is equal to 30 now so if z value is 0 then x value will be 11 and uh, y value will be 13 second case if z square is equal plus 1 is equal to 2 then what you will get uh, you will get a uh, z value you will get plus or minus 1 so if z value is 1 if z value is 1 uh, then uh, x will be x value will be 12 now. z value is uh, 1 x value will be 12 uh, and uh, y value 1 now. y value 1 so here uh, how will you get this uh? so here uh, x square plus y square into z square plus 1 z value 1 1 plus 1 is equal to 290 so x square plus y square is equal to here what will get 145 will get so here uh, 145 means here you can write it as 1 square 1 square plus 12 square or you can write it as a 12 square plus 1 square 12 square plus 1 square so here uh, if z value is uh, minus 1 z value is minus 1 uh, then x value is uh, <coughs> minus 1 uh, so here also you will get the same x value 1 and uh, y value 12 ok next if you take uh, if z is equal to <coughs> if <coughs> z square plus 1 equal to 5 then z equal to plus or minus 2 if z is equal to 2 then uh, x equal to 7 and y is equal to minus 3 or x equal to minus 3 and y is equal to 7 first one does not satisfy the second one will satisfy <coughs> z is equal to minus 2 So the second one will satisfy. Huh? Next, uh, if z square is plus one is equal to ten, then uh, z is equal to plus or minus three. If z is equal to three, then x is equal to minus two, and y is equal to five. z is equal to minus 3 then x is equal to 23 by 5 and y is equal to minus 14 by 5 not integer next uh, if z square uh, plus 1 is equal to 145 then uh, z is equal to plus or minus 12 if z is equal to 12 then x is equal to 1 and y is equal to minus 1 if z is equal to minus 12 then x is equal to 119 by 145 calculation part is more huh? That's why directly we are getting the answer here. Not integer. So here, uh, if z square plus 1 is equal to 290, 
दिस इज द लास्ट केस ऑफ देन जेड इज इक्वल टू प्लस आर माइनस सेवेंटीन इफ जेड इज इक्वल टू सेवेंटीन देन एक्स इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी बाय ट्वेंटी नाइन एंड वाई इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी वन बाय ट्वेंटी नाइन नॉट इंटीजर इफ जेड इज इक्वल टू माइनस सेवेंटीन then x is equal to minus 3 by 5 and y is equal to 4 by 5 it is also not integer therefore <coughs> the solutions are you can check out huh? the solutions what you are getting uh, here uh, माइनस थ्री सेवन माइनस टू माइनस थ्री सेवन माइनस टू माइनस वन वन माइनस ट्वेल्व माइनस वन ट्वेल्व माइनस वन फाइव माइनस टू थ्री लेवन थर्टीन जीरो एंड ट्वेल्व कामा वन कामा वन so these are the six solutions we are having integer solutions to this problem so thank you for watching i am cg max i hope you understood the problem so long process ama <coughs> you can um, try it ama so here uh, if you like the video subscribe the channel and share the video to your friends thank you once again for watching i am cg max olympiad